Did y'all see Alfonso Ribeiro's tweet? Shade and Tyler Perry. What did happen? Hey, what's up everybody? This is your girl Miss P. Hopefully you were doing fantastic. Make sure to go ahead and like this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Turn on those notifications so you know when another video comes out. And please make sure you follow me on the social medias, honey. If you haven't been on X, you should have seen by now Alfonso Ribeiro. He has, um some interesting things to say in regards to Tyler Perry. Well, technically it was only one statement, but I was sitting there like, wait, what had happened? Out of nowhere, this comes out of left field. If you don't know Alfonso Ribeiro or you don't know who I'm alluding to, you've been under a rock, you haven't watched um, 90s television. Alfonso Ribeiro is popularly known for his role as Carlton Banks from The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. And now I know him for hosting America's Funniest Videos as well as Dancing with the Stars. Now he doesn't really speak of Carlton because he says that role really ruined his career. He says the name itself brings him pain and for having a role such as Carlton he was typecast for many years even now looking at him you think of Carlton but it makes me think of other celebrities stars such as Jaleel White you know known for Steve Urkel like I'm always gonna look at him and think of Lauren did I do that I'm always gonna think of that anytime I look at Alfonso Ribeiro I'm really going to think of Carlton I'm really gonna think about that like I'm sorry y'all took the role at the end of the day the day gonna end, okay? And these people are actors, okay? So to walk up to somebody and use their stage name or who they're best known for, some are like, okay, and some are like, please don't do that. So, uh, I don't know. If you recognize somebody, I just feel like in the future, just give them a little bro man head nod. I'll be like, are you? or an actor or an actress and you know let them fill in the blank but some people I feel like if you are singer actor whatever athlete what have you and you don't like what you used to do that's your business <laughs> so out of the blue I mean just randomly and you know how x is twitter is always gonna be so random people can post anything anytime i'm sorry i'm never gonna get used to calling twitter x like i'm never gonna get used to that you know how you say twitter and you say oh i was tweeting what do you say now like i'm always say tweeting like i don't know what to say but either way somebody tweeted and they said this let's 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 go ahead and go down the rabbit hole of x by the way make sure you follow me on x at miss tp90 honey i tweet i'm, I'm doing my thing so yeah basically i'm looking on alfonso ribeiro's x profile and uh, uh someone tweeted tag tyler perry and said tyler perry needs to revamp at alfonso ribeiro's career i just know he could now here's the thing Sometimes on these social medias, including YouTube, people just be talking and they don't even know the facts. They don't know how this man is doing. They don't even know if he needs a revamp. How he's living. Y'all remember that show on BET? How is he living? And I think he's doing fine. He's hosting. He was just on Kelly and Mark. Oh my God, it's called Kelly and Mark. And they married. Honey, I'm late to the show. But he was just on there talking about the upcoming season finale. So, I mean, come Oh, I think he's doing just fine. And then he was at the PGA Tour of Champions. At the time that I was looking at this, it was at 2 million. Now it's at 10 million views of just a post. Oh, wow. That's amazing. That's what that person says. And then he follows up. And this is what we're talking about right now. He says, I don't need or ever want that man to do anything for me. Damn! That man, I, whoo, those were some heavy words. You know what I mean? Um, it felt like it was it was heavy, or maybe he was following up with somebody saying or revamping his career, and he was thinking, "Hey, I already got a career." Like I don't know. And then another thing, I'm looking at X. Like you, you can't respond to everything somebody says, especially if it doesn't pertain to you. Sometimes people be projecting. Sometimes people see what you do and think you could be doing what you used to do. You know what I'm saying? Y'all remember when Jeffrey Owen? People were saying all that stuff about him because he was working at a grocery store I believe it was and they were like oh my god what had happened to him and then Tyler Perry I believe gave him a role you remember he played Elvin on the Cosby show and I guess people were alluding to that with how oh my god you can have a resurgence I'm gonna click on it and we're gonna see what a lot of people are saying uh for those in the industry everyone doesn't consider working with Tyler Perry a step up there's a term chitlin circuit used and it's not meant to be complimentary oh now somebody said now that's a wild term why so he can cast him as a down low preacher that beats his wife oh ooh, ooh, child 
He directed eight episodes of Meet the Browns, so he's worked with him already. Mm, somebody has the juice. I'm trying to tell y'all, people can find some stuff. So as we are getting back to it, he's already directed some episodes of Tyler Perry's Meet the Browns, and he's worked with him already. Now, some people don't work well with other people. Sometimes it just don't work out. But what I've heard, Tyler Perry, I mean, you either can work with him or you can't. And child, you can fill in those blanks. I don't know. I've never worked with the man. He has a career. He works with Disney and hosts Dancing with the Stars. Great host, but acting career is dead. <laughs> Looks like Alfonso said, pause. No diddy. <laughs> Will Smith need to put him in the next Bad Boys movie. Huh? I never understood why he wasn't in something with Will, at least Independence Day. I'm trying to think how, what, I'm really trying to think of what, I, I can't, I don't see that, but that's just me. Child, if anybody could revamp his career, it sure wouldn't be Tyler. Alfonso is not really castable, to be honest. He's too short and stubby. Oh, well now, maybe Tyler could cast him in something. Oh, why are people taking this post wrong the wrong way? You never said for Tyler Perry to create a show for him. Tyler Perry could have connected him with other, what? Revamp his career. I literally just saw him over the weekend doing like four hours of America's Funniest Home Videos. He's good. I wish that black folk would understand that many of us actors have trained and studied extensively to be actors. The body of work which comes from Tyler Perry is usually below standard, poorly written scripts with one dimensional characters. Tyler Perry is not a come up for serious actors. Ooh. What are you talking about? You do understand that Carlton can sit home, eat potato chips in his slippers, and wait for the mailman to bring him a check every day, right? Fresh Prince went into syndication about 30 years ago. If he works now, it's because he wants to. Y'all saw C-Note's response. He don't need or want nothing from that man. Woo, child. Everybody just go ahead and leave Alfonso alone, honey. Keep um doing America's Funniest Videos. Keep doing what you want to do. Let Tyler Perry be in his lane and ain't going to be no traffic. Comment down below and let me know your thoughts on everything that's going on. The tweet, uh, what Alfonso said. Do you think they should work together? Let's talk about this down below. Thank y'all so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace, love, and all. That good stuff. God bless. Bye.